Hello, this is Dennis with A1 Telephone Service and Repair, A1 Electronics. You can reach us on the web at www.a1-telephone.com and you can also reach us at 618-235-6959. Today I want to show you a really cool TS-22 and this is Rod's equipment from Indiana and this is the initial checkout of this really cool lineman's butt set. We're going to run through a little bit about what needs to be done with this unit. We're going to replace the primary battery. We also want to add a battery socket for the primary battery. That way in the future if the primary battery ever goes bad you can simply replace it by removing the old primary battery from the battery socket and just replacing it with a new primary battery makes for a simple repair of this unit. Now the PC board in this unit and most all TS-22s have a coating on the board and it makes it very difficult to remove the primary battery because you have to peel that coating back and remove the battery without tearing up any of the traces on the PC board. So just removing the primary battery from this unit is not a simple process. We have a lot of work that needs to be done. We want to get a start on this unit. We'll go ahead and take some still pictures of this really cool TS-22 lineman's butt set and we'll come back and get some more video as we move forward in the troubleshooting and repairing process. We'll take a short break and we'll be right back. Okay, we're back now, and we're finished up with the repair of this really cool TS-22 lineman's butt set, and we're ready to start our final checkout. Now, we want to run through a few things about this unit. This unit came equipped with a piezo buzzer for the ring cycle. If you were to get a call, you would hear a piezo buzzer slightly. I'm not sure that the video will pick up that piezo buzzer, but we will show that in the final checkout. Now we also want to mention that the analyzer is set up for proper polarity and the main line out is set up for improper polarity. And the reason is the TS-22 has LED light indicators that show what polarity you are when you're on a line. So we'll go ahead and show that in the final checkout. Now what we want to do is go ahead and use the analyzer and send a ring cycle like you were getting a call. So we'll start that. We'll let that go a few times. I'll let it go one more time and we'll give you some dial tone. We're going to go ahead and use the amplifier. There's three settings. We're just going to use low. If you watch the analyzer, you'll watch the numbers roll by. I'm going to end in a two. We want to go ahead and hang up. You will hear a little bit of a hum from the amplifier. I'm going to hit the last number redial and the analyzer will end in a 2. Now you will notice 
there is no LED light indicator for polarity when you're in the amplification mode. So now what we want to do is turn the amplifier off. And our LED light lit. We can hang up. And it shows proper polarity. Now what we want to do is dial a 2. And I want to transmit into the handset. If you watch that red light on the analyzer, every time you see that red light light up, that's an indication of 100% modulation on transmit. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Hello? Hello. We can go ahead and hang our unit up. Now that we know that this unit is ringing in on a ring cycle, we're dialing out. We have transmit and receive. We can go ahead and press this button on the switch box. That'll give us a line out, totally take the analyzer out of the situation, and we can call a time and temp number. We're also going to call my number, and it will be busy. Now, we're going to use the stored function. I stored the time and temp number under number two, and I stored my shop number under number one. So now what we want to do is go ahead and give you some dial tone. Our LED is showing a red LED, which is improper polarity. We want to hit the first level of volume. Recall two. my number and it'll be busy. Give you some dial tone. Recall one. We can go ahead and hang our unit up. Now that we know that this really cool TS-22 lineman's butt set has been converted with the primary battery and a socket we can return this unit back to Rod and he can enjoy this lineman's butt set once again I'm sure he's going to get plenty of use out of it in the field this is Dennis with A1 Telephone Service and Repair A1 Electronics you can reach us on the web at www.a1-telephone.com and you can also reach us at 618-235-6959. Thank you for watching and have a great day.